full Magic Mesh will snap close behind you. That makes it great for pets too, because instead of scratching and whining, they can come and go as they please. And it puts an end to slamming doors because it closes gently every time. Plus, it's so easy to install. No nails, no screws, no tools. Goes up in seconds and stays up all season long, no matter how often you, your kids, or your dog go through. So let the fresh air in and keep those annoying bugs out with Magic Mesh, a $40 value yours for just $19.95. Best of all, Magic Mesh saves you money because when it's nice, leave those doors open. You won't have to use air conditioning. And when the weather turns chilly, just take it down and store it away for next year. But wait, call right now and you'll double the offer. Just pay separate processing and handling. Use one for your sliding door and one for your back door. One for your home and the other for your RV. That's right, you get two Magic Mesh curtains for just $19.95. That's less than $10 each. Don't you let Call and order yours today. Call 1-800-959-0237 to order Magic Mesh for $19.95 plus processing and handling or log on to buymagicmesh.com. Call or log on now. She is Julia Honey, who looks beautiful in the yellow dress of Dave Durman on Facebook. Uh, you're on Facebook. I'm going to jump on Twitter right now because the story we're talking about this morning about going on vacation. A lot of people go on vacation. But, and now we're in this trend where over the past 10 years, people feel compelled to not just set up auto responders on their email and say, hey, I'm on vacation for this week. Don't bother me. Right. Now they feel compelled to not only tweet and use Facebook, but also set up auto responders while they're away on vacation for social media. Case in point. Get boring now. Case in point. So this is all for So what does it say your family is supposed to be with your family on vacation and you're sitting there tweeting and, and sending photos of your beach shots to friends? <laughs> <laughs> Look, no, a reason to get like, right again. Yeah, well, a reason to get like 58 percent of people do that on vacation, tweet and Facebook. That's up from 28 percent a year earlier. One early. year ago. So we actually can't go on social media vacation. Here's an email from John. I see people who text while walking, walk right into doors and other obstructions. We're so technologically advanced that having a great vacation with the kids is a lost part. Yeah. Okay, I can maybe give it to you when you're on vacation with the kids and all that stuff. But when you're on vacation, so then it's just quiet time, and you know the hours yeah. start going by, and you start going, okay, you what know, you get it up the beach. Yeah. All right, I get that. Here's another tweet this morning. I'll read this. Uh, this one comes from Norm Hammond. He says, yes, I'm on vacation. I can't get on the internet. I go nuts. This was me a few weeks ago. No internet connection, and I started getting the shakes. Another tweet, my family is not allowed to have cell computer on during the day and only one hour after dinner. Family time. And Clayton has challenged me. I'm going on vacation in a couple of weeks. Uh, no tweets, no Facebook. Where are you going? Nothing. Give a bet. Going over to the UK, cross the pond. So our bet is that if you tweet, if I see a tweet come from you, mm -hmm. uh, you're going to buy me dinner at Fish and Chips and Guinness. This is all your fault, man. I never did any social networking until I met you. You, you, you created the model. A lot of people have played. Just put, but you're sitting there, uh, you guys are honestly, and during the commercial break, during the segments. During the segments. Exactly. Right I know, now, I know. Yeah. All right, well, you're obsessed with it. Just put it down. And, and we make that noise, too. It's FF yeah. Weekend on Twitter, for those of you who don't follow. All right, some uh, headlines now. New video of Secretary of State Hillary Clinton in Indonesia. She just announced North Korea's vice foreign minister will visit New York this week to talk about resuming talks over North Korea's nuclear program. The news comes just two days after negotiators from North and South Korea met for the first time in three years. A lot of people are wounded when shots are fired at a lowrider car show outside of Seattle, Washington. Everybody who was hurt is expected to survive. No one has been arrested and no word on how many shooters were involved, we say. Gunfire started after an argument turned into a fight. They say it may have been game-related. Arnold Schwarzenegger will revise his divorce papers. That's the one that he signed. Uh, this time he's going to make sure his estranged wife, Maria Schreiber, will receive spousal support. Last week, if you recall, a uh, little press, he signed papers denying her spousal support. He has a lot of money. He importantly didn't read the documents carefully, and he never intended to deny her money in the first place. 
uh, Congress couldn't cut a deal to keep the FAA running this week. So that means tax-free airline tickets. We were so excited. We were giddy yesterday. Well, only two airlines will be passing that 7% savings. Count to you. Virgin America and Spirit Airlines. However, airlines like Delta Southwest, Air Trans, and United will still collect speed and rumor is they're going to keep it while Congress gets the tax together. Also rumored to be keeping the profits, U.S. Airways and Spirit Airlines. We have a lot to say about this one, and most of you agree with Jim on Twitter. He tweets, no surprise, since airlines have been anti consumer for years. I mean, I think I took a mistake about when they started charging for the bag. And the beginning of the little snack. Yeah, you and the Yeah. Another big snub for the bitter Wigglebox twins. You know those guys? Their interesting last name. They claim they created Facebook. Wigglebox. Not only did they did the judge just dismiss their lawsuit against the real Facebook and uh, its founder Mark Zuckerberg, but word is the guy who played both twins in the movie, the, the Social Network, is set to cash in on their unpopularity once again. Army Hammer is signed on to play both Victor Vi in an upcoming <laughs> episode of The Simpsons where he's going to try to steal Lisa's up and coming social network idea. <laughs> yeah, he played both parts. I thought they were twins. Yeah. And after the movie, he played both parts. It's ridiculous. It's incredible. All right, Master 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 Master
obliging people to believe. Not that that has ever been Campus Crusade's message, but yes, if you say, I'm part of Campus Crusade, hey, why are you talking to me? Why are you trying to get me to come to your event? Well, what do you think about? Are you concerned that people